What is going on, beautiful people? How was your day? Happy St. Patrick's Day to you all. Uh, I know for probably a lot of you, for most of you, uh, it has no significance. It's just a day for you to wear green. Uh, yeah. I got my green on, my uh, camo hunting shirt. Uh, some for uh, for some reason this is the only article of green clothing that I have at school and it's kind of ironic because green is my favorite color and I think it's definitely one of my least owned colors when it comes to clothing but yeah it's St. Patrick's Day uh, day to celebrate St. Patrick uh, from Ireland uh, I know school is having some event today. Uh, I think it's like loaded potatoes or something like that um, for St. Patrick's. Let's see if I can get over here. <sighs> I hate city driving. It's terrible. But other than that, it is just a normal day here uh, in Fort Wayne. Heading to class right now. I said I was going to go to the gym this morning, but... Uh, well, I did. I ended up going to the gym. You guys just didn't see it. I walked in there a little bit later. I decided I wanted a little bit more sleep today because I have an, my exam, or one of my exams today, and I walked in there, and everyone was there. Like, I've never seen that gym so full, and so, like, I just didn't feel comfortable. I didn't know if anyone else felt comfortable being filmed. I didn't want to just deal with it, so I just did my work, got in, got out type thing, and got ready for my day so pulling on to campus now um got calculus to go to review day today for the exam tomorrow uh, hopefully i understand a lot more of this than i think i do because this class is rough but it's gonna be a great day to be a great day uh so i'm gonna head inside gonna fill up my water bottle first before class and yeah, then I'm not sure really when I'll see you guys next, but I guess you guys will find out. So, talk to you later. All right, guys. So, day. Pull that down. I'm outside all by myself. Uh, day almost done. Um, it is St. Patrick's today, like I said. Uh, so, the school's putting on an event. Got myself a loaded baked potato. It smells delicious. Can't wait to eat that. Um, currently going on a walk around the uh what is normally a river but uh i don't know if you guys can see there's not much water in there um water levels are very 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 low i don't know why um but what was a river is now just a muddy delta looking thing but uh yeah, kind of unfortunate. The river is really pretty when it's a river. Yeah, just take a look, like, you can see a little bit of water there, but like, all of that is just mud. What the heck happened? That is crazy. But it is just a gorgeous day outside. Absolutely beautiful, slight breeze, but it is still beautiful out here, so. Decided I uh, would take advantage of the wonderful weather and uh, take a walk before my exam at 3.30 or 4.30. So I got, what, two hours? So decided to take a walk. I got a decent amount of work to get done. Um, so decided to take scenic route to Kettler before doing my work. I have heard, though, that are from someone in the same class same professor but before me so like he's in the morning section i'm in the afternoon section he had already taken his exam he didn't tell me what was on it but it said it was really easy for him it took him about 20 20 minutes of the 50 minutes allotted so that makes me feel a lot better about this exam that i felt severely underprepared for me got a little uh geese buddies up here let's see what's up 
Hey, buddies. How's it going? No, you stay away. You back off. Back off. Freaking looking chickens. <clears throat> I'll eat you. Eat both of you. They're gonna get it. Just look at them. Look at all goose like. And in good news, I don't know if I said this earlier, I may have, but uh, Daphne seems to be doing much, much better today. Uh, said she hasn't thrown up in a while, she hasn't felt sick. I mean, a little stuffy nose, but other than that, she feels worlds better than what she did yesterday. And turns out, around home, uh, there's this big, like, 24 hour, 12 hour flu bug just going around that's like wiping everyone out. Uh, but only for, like I said, 12 to 24 hours. So it's looking like she got whatever that is. Luckily, I don't think I got it. I mean, there's a few days where I just had a real sore throat and earaches, but I don't know if that was this stuff or if I just had allergies or if it was the changing weather. I, I don't know. But I think she's actually in Kettler right now. And I'm walking up on Kettler. There's a science building behind me. Um, so I'm going to go in and see if I can find her. And maybe she'll talk to you guys. Probably not. She doesn't like you guys. Daphne took my potato. I did not. You gave me your potato. Do you want your potato? No, thanks. Take your potato. Ooh, whoa, that was a cool, like, it, like, focused on the potato. That's a lot of butter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I could use more butter though. Mm -hmm. Sour cream. Yeah, Wendy's I didn't. I didn't get. I didn't get sour cream. Wendy's baked potato sounds fantastic right now. Mm -hmm. Like a little sour cream, the butter. You know what sounds very hot head sounds really good. Mm -hmm. Sour cream sounds really good. Yeah, she's feeling better today. Whew! My goodness, what a day! What a day! The day's over. Engineering exam down, way easier than I expected, way less material than I expected. It was a total of two questions. It took me a total of 20 minutes to complete. Um, I sent my answers. Well, I turned in the exam, obviously, before the due date. And then I was talking to my ment mentor afterwards just because, you know, she's curious about how the exam was and what was on it, just so she can get a better gauge, you know, if she has to, uh, if she has to teach the class over again. Dude. Dude, like, didn't stop at that intersection. Like, he is halfway into that intersection and about drilled me. What the heck? But, yeah, like I was saying before I about died, um, my mentor just... She likes to know, like, what the test was like, what was on it, just so she can give tips and tricks and everything for people, you know, next year or next semester, or, you know, going through it. And I sent her my answers from it, um, and she said everything that was on my paper looked right, so if I answered the question, if my answers were answering the question, then I should have no problem on this uh, exam. I'm expecting to miss some points. Uh, this professor is fairly nitpicky on just notation and how things are organized, but it is what it is. But then I spent the next several hours working on a bunch of stuff. I had to do an entire presentation that I had to create. I have to still write the technical report for it. Um, that's due tomorrow. I started writing a paper for history that I completely forgot about that's due next Friday. Um, I have my NSLS, National Society of Leadership and Success, um, orientation tonight. It's actually in like half an hour. Um, it is pretty late. I still have to eat um, and I still have to study for calc. I have the calc exam tomorrow. That one I am very nervous about. Um, so got to get a lot of things done tonight. So I think the responsible thing to do would be to wrap up this vlog right now so I don't have to worry about it tonight when I'm actually doing stuff and trying to be focused and, you know, be productive. So in order to wrap it up, you got to give you guys fact of the day. So fact of the day for today. Uh, today is St. Patrick's Day, as you guys are well aware of already. Um, so I'll give you guys fact about 
St. Patrick's Day. So, St. Patrick's Day, the first, like, known celebration of St. Patrick's Day, like, holiday-wise, was in Boston, Massachusetts, in 1737. So, about almost 40 years before we were even a nation, we were celebrating St. Patrick's Day here in the States. Well, it was the colonies back then, but the States. But, yeah, so... I think that's going to wrap it up for today. If you guys did enjoy today's vlog, don't be afraid to hit the like button down below. Share it with everyone, you know. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. I really do appreciate all of the support that I'm getting from you guys. It does mean a lot to me. I, um, yeah. So, I hope you guys stick around. I'll see you tomorrow. And I shall be seeing all of you tomorrow on another day in the life of a dumb vlog. Peace.